and this video is day four of Vlogmas. So today, you're probably gonna hear some cartoons in the background. I'm gonna put some music over it. Hopefully it won't be too crazy, but my son is on his tablet. Can't do nothing about that. If I try to turn his tablet off, it's gonna be a whole nother issue. So he's gonna rock with it. All right, so today I'm just coming like almost with another review. So if you watched my video yesterday, the you the bomb is, that's not a word. The, you the best, okay? My hair look crazy, I know. I came in because yesterday on day three of Vlogmas, if you didn't already watch that video, I'm gonna put it in the comments down below. So after you watch this, you can click on that link and watch that video too, okay? So I was telling y'all how I've been using the Milk Hydro Grip Primer and I love how that worked. And yesterday my makeup, I loved it. It was bomb, it was beautiful. But I got a little shiny. Now when I use the NYX, shine killer i don't get shiny so i thought if i use them together that would work so now today as you can see i went all day and i don't feel like i'm as shiny but i feel like my makeup moves a little bit more and maybe that's just me like i feel like i'm getting the color the oxidation is the colors are changing and they're kind of separating more than i felt like they did yesterday so in my opinion, I think it's just too much product. Those two different primers, I think them used together, together, it's probably not a good idea. But I mean, I still like the makeup. I think it's still like on, but it's definitely not as cute as how I felt like it was at the end of the day yesterday. So today I'm just going to come to you with how I take my makeup off. So I do a few things because if you wear makeup every day, you know just using one makeup wipe never gets all of your makeup off. So I use a couple things to remove my makeup. So I figured I would share those with you today. Okay, so let's get right into it. So the first thing I use is the Neutrogena makeup remover wipes. So I just take one of these. Now, I also use the crayon case makeup removal wipes, but I ran out of those. So that's why I've been using these. But as soon as I run out of those, I'm going back to the crayon case. So both of those wipes to me are bomb. Woo! So, first I use this to take my makeup wipe. First, I use the makeup wipes to get the makeup off. And I just, again, like, start from the bottom of my face and I just work my way up. So, with wearing eyeliner and mascara, the eye makeup is the hardest part to get off because it has dried and it has set. So, it gives you a very difficult time when taking it off. I know it seems like this is a lot, but to be perfectly honest, this is the minimal makeup, how it comes off. Ain't that crazy? Ain't that crazy? All right. So I try to get as much off as possible with the makeup wipe that I can. So, to me, a lot of the makeup is off. It really is. But when you wash your face, you're going to see, like, I would just use one makeup remover wipe. And then I would go immediately in to wash my face. And I would see that my face still had a lot, a lot of makeup on it, right? So, I don't just remove my makeup with only a makeup wipe anymore. 
I go a couple steps further. So I use some cotton rounds and these are from the body shop. I like these because they're like, they have like this weird texture on this side and then a different texture on this side. I don't know if that is really any benefit, but I like it, it feels good. And so the next product that I'm gonna use is the Michelin Cleansing Water all in one and so this removes makeup and i really just start off with my face especially my chin because i feel like see how much makeup is still on my face like even though it looks like the makeup is off it's still so much on there and i don't feel like i really get my chin good because it's so much makeup that I see on my face, so I focus there first. And then the makeup wipe is already dry before I can even really get to my chin. So, this gets a lot of the makeup off. Uh-oh. Here comes AJ. What you got, big boy? You got a toy? Yes? Okay. All right, so I used more than one of these. So as you can see, it looks like we got all the makeup off and look how much dirt was still on my face. That is why I stopped only using a makeup wipe to remove my makeup. And again, to me, I want my face to have all of the makeup off before I wash it. So again, this is just how I remove my makeup. This is not like my nightly like face wash routine. I wash my face with a cleanser, but I like to do that after all my makeup is off. Because I really want to get, you know, not only the makeup off, but also the dirt and stuff like that would have comes just from my natural oils and things and I feel like I can't get deep into that cleanse with the makeup still on my face so that's why I do this and then this helps get a lot of the eye makeup off as well see all of that And you want to be gentle because you don't want to give yourself bags or make it any more crazy. Make your um, <clears throat> eyes any more puffy than your natural life already makes it. So, be careful. Alright, so again, this one is still so much makeup left on there. I go ahead in with one more. And then, this time, I'm going to use a cleansing facial toner and this is from the brand Inez. i don't know how to say that but i love this because they got this like cute little message on it says can i speak to your manager i think that is so cute so i take this and i spray it on my face first and then i spray some also onto the the cotton rail and i wipe my face off again. <laughs> Say hi, IJ. You worry about us. Okay, so um, again, we still have makeup on there, but. This right here is a minimal amount for me to go ahead and proceed with cleansing my face. So, that is my how I take my makeup off routine. If you think I'm doing too much and I just need to go ahead and use my cleanser and I'm wasting my time, comment down below. Let me know, like, sis, all that's not necessary. You could just wash your face, okay? But I think this works for me. I like to get a lot of the makeup off before I wash my face. It just makes me feel like my face is cleaner at the end of the night. So, 
All I can say is, I just want to please, 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 please ask you to subscribe. Yeah, so before you leave, please make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, you want to hit that bell. Turn on your post notifications. Make sure you like, comment, and share this video. Share it with everybody. Share it with your mama, your daddy, your cousins, your uncles, your grannies, your sister, brother, auntie, nephew, baby daddy. Oh, co-worker, fourth grade teacher, everybody. Just share with everybody. I just want to thank you so much for tuning in today for Vlogmas. If you haven't noticed already, we're going back to back to back. I am trying to make it to Christmas. I really want to do 25 videos in a row because I think Vlogmas is lit. I love Christmas, as you can see. My tree. Y'all, y'all, why y'all ain't tell me I ain't turn a tree on? What nobody gonna tell me I ain't turn the tree lights on? Y'all so wrong for that. I'm sitting here telling y'all all my teeth. And y'all ain't nobody gonna tell me I ain't turn on the tree. It's okay. It's okay. I still love y'all though. I appreciate y'all. And I'ma see y'all in day five of Vlogmas.